Hello everyone, this is Dan Gramza and welcome to Gramza Market Studies for Tuesday, June 23rd. Let's see what happened with these stock markets here. Let's start with that NASDAQ. And what we did see is we see a market that firmed up based upon what's happening with Greece as well as some economic results we had in the United States. Yes, it's higher. I'm concerned about this. It implies a down day on Tuesday based upon the price action, but actually I'm looking for an unchanged type day. If you take a look at the currencies, the euro continues in a sideways mode. As I mentioned, I was looking for a sideways move for Monday. That's what I'm looking for that to continue until we get some kind of resolution with our friends in Greece. If we move on and take a look at the interest rate markets, 10-year note backs off as the stock market got stronger. I like that kind of behavior. I'm looking for further movement to the downside, but not a, a rapid move uh, to the downside. Gold backs off as some of the excuses we needed for uncertainty. It's kind of been taken out of the market. The difference here between that bearish and bullish level in that market is $900 a contract. Remember, there's also micro gold contracts that you can trade as well. But let's move on and let's take a look at what's happening in the energy market. Here we had a sideways move. That's what I was looking for. I'm looking for more of the same when it comes to Tuesday's action. And in the grain, soybean continues to get stronger. We're looking for an unchanged to higher type move, but not a dramatic move in our friend, Mr. Bean. And that concludes today's market studies. Thank you for being with me. I'm looking forward to being with you again. And as always, take care.